I'm Taj Rust. I'm a visual artist based in New York. I'm in Palm Springs for the opening of my exhibition at the Palm Springs Art Museum titled Reflections. These works are all largely based on photographs that I've taken myself. I travel quite a bit and some of these paintings are based on people I've met in Brazil, in Senegal, and in the United States. There are elements of the paintings that are invented. During my process, I'll incorporate drawing and test out different color combinations and palettes to evoke different moods and emotions. In the end, the result is a, I guess, a pastiche of different references kind of brought together through the process of painting. I'm a, primarily a painter. I have experimented with working with glass. There are uh, representations of glass in several of these paintings, particularly the windows, which reflect some of the figures, uh, hence the title Reflections. It's also a pun, it's a play on words. Reflections also refers to a lot of the expressions that you see throughout. The figures are all pretty much in a pensive, reflective, meditative state, so you get to see them thinking and looking out and the gaze meets the viewers. And a lot of these figures are pretty much a one-to-one -one scale to the human body and I think it kind of makes the viewer feel more of a connection subconsciously if they're engaging with someone that feels like a real person. All of these paintings are done in both acrylic and oil. Acrylic allows me to kind of get an idea down quickly and then as the painting goes on I layer oil on top to kind of refine it, bring out the more intricate details. I did generate this painting out of several drawings over several months and then when I finally started painting it, it continued to evolve. Um, it started just with a domestic space that I knew I wanted to flood with water and then I wanted to have all these little moments throughout that kind of like are their own paintings in a way. My favorite part of the painting actually are all the photographs hanging on the walls. The photographs are kind of these uh, abstracted moments and if you look closely some of the I guess body language or poses that you see in the foreground are like echoed in some of the photographs as well. The figures are both real and imagined. Um, in fact, I think there's one figure on the far right that uh, is a man dissolving into a shadow. And it's an idea that I've kind of been um, experimenting with, you know, thinking of visibility, um, what's recognizable, what is mysterious. And that man is based on myself. Like I did the pose and kind of like uh, painted out the details to kind of make him one with that space. The smallest painting in this exhibition is titled Study of a Memory. It's based on uh, a person I, I saw on one of my walks um, through Brooklyn. It was just like a striking image that I thought would have been interesting to capture, but instead of photographing the man, I decided to do it from memory. Because of that, there are some rules that I break in terms of like traditional perspective. It kind of is just like a combination of elements um, composed into a painting. 